President Mohamedou Buhari has insisted that the security situation in the country has improved and would be consolidated, while more attention will be given to the economy before handing over on May 29. The President stated this when he received the executive members of the Catholic Bishops' Conference of Nigeria, CBCN. President Buhari noted that the security situation, particularly in the Northeast, was far better now as focus has shifted to the rebuilding of infrastructure and reorientation of education. The chairman of the Independent National Electoral Commission, Ainek Mahmoud Yakubu, has met with the leadership of the 18 political parties at the commission's headquarters in Abuja. At the meeting, the commission's chairman presented the 2023 voters register to the parties as required by the 2022 Electoral Act. In attendance at the meeting included leaders of the All Progressives Congress, the People's Democratic Party, the Labour Party, the New Nigeria People's Party, among others. The INEC chairman said with the presentation of the voters register, the commission has successfully implemented 11 out of the 14 activities scheduled for the 2023 general elections. The commission has now successfully implemented 11 out of 14 activities on schedule. Furthermore, the implementation of other activities has proceeded in earnest. The commission is not contemplating any adjustment to the election timetable, let alone postponement of the general election. The repeated assurance by the security agencies for the adequate protection of personnel, materials, and processes also reinforces our determination to proceed. The 2023 general election will hold a schedule. We are equally aware of some of the frictions in the system to ensure that the effort of the commission is truncated in line. But uh, whatever it is that will be anti-democratic in the system, parties will resist it and ensure that uh, this democracy does not fail. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.